Action News Jax investigates is looking into letters local voters have been getting in their mailboxes. It's a notice from an organization called Voter Participation Center asking about registrations. Action News Jax Courtney Cole is live at Oakley Baptist Church, one of the polling places in Clay County. And Courtney, voters all over our area are receiving these letters. That's right, John. So Clay County Supervisor of Elections, they're the ones who raised the red flag, but I spoke to the Supervisor of Elections in Duval and St. John's County, and they tell me neighbors have reached out to them because they've received them too. Here's the problem. The Supervisor of Elections are worried that when it's time for neighbors to come out to their polling places like the one here, that there's going to be some confusion. So on this notice that Clay County neighbors received most recently, it's telling voters that they either aren't registered to vote, they need to change their mailing address or that it's just time to update their voter registration. And it's confusing because some voters are saying that information is simply not true. I spoke to a Clay County voter today who says she hasn't received one of those specific notices, but she had a similar experience. Might have been about three or four months ago. I think uh, it was uh, several guys that was out finding out whether or not you are a voter or you registered right. and everything like that. Um, I'm already a registered voter, so I had no problem. Our mission is to register and mobilize what we call the rising American electorate. That means unmarried women, people of color, and young people. The reason why we focus on these demographics is because they represent a huge uh, number of the people who are eligible to vote, but don't vote in, in the numbers that, that they actually represent. They're, they are underrepresented demographics. And while the Voter Participation Center has helped to register many here in Florida, they describe themselves as the middleman. And they're saying if you have any questions, that it's always your supervisor of elections that you should refer to. Reporting live in Clay County, Courtney Cole, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jack.